Hi Chalkers, this is Jacqueline with Happiness is Created with Magnolia Design Company. Today I'll be showing you the basics of chalk painting with Magnolia Design Company chalk paste and stencils. Let me show you a few things that you'll need to get started. You'll need a surface to chalk onto, and today I'll be using this small chalkboard for demonstration purposes. You could chalk on wood, glass, or any other hard surface. You can chalk paste on just about anything. It's not permanent until you seal it. So suppose we'd like to make a design today display it in our house for the next couple of months and when new stencils come out maybe put something else on the same chalkboard you would simply spritz it with some water take your cleaning sponge wash it off and you'd be ready to use this same chalkboard for your new design so in addition to the surface you're going to need to select a stencil. This was an eight and a half by 11 collection of farmhouse stencils. I simply cut them apart and now we have six smaller stencils. I've selected Life is Better on the Farm for today's demonstration. You're also going to need a Sharpie, chalk paste, and a squeegee. We'll be using the smaller squeegee today since we're going to stencil a small surface using the smaller stencil. And we have our cleaning sponge just in case we make a mistake and we like to wash it off. So the first thing you want to do to get started is take your Sharpie and write on the back of your stencil. And this serves two purposes. One, you'll know what back to put your stencil back on in case you were working with multiple stencils at one time. And also, after you get through washing your stencil and letting it dry, you would know which side to reapply it to on the, surf, on the backing. One side is a little more sticky than the other. So the first thing we're going to do after putting the name on the back is simply peel the stencil off of the backing. Just like so. And then I'm going to do what we call fuzzing the stencil, which is simply just to put it down on a microfiber cloth a few times, just to help get a little bit of the sticky off of the back so that when we get ready to take it off of our surface, it's not so hard to come up and it's less likely that we would stretch our stencil out of place. If you haven't heard of Magnolia Design Company before, chances are that's because we're new. We've only been in business for a year. We just celebrated our one year anniversary. We specialize in silk screen reusable stencils. Chalk paste, inks, and we have our own collection of surfaces as well. So now that we have fuzzed our stencil, we're simply going to place it on our chalkboard like so. Smoothing it out, making sure 
that it's adhered to our surface well, getting out any wrinkles or bubbles that we may have. Then you would want to get your chalk paste and check the consistency of that. We're looking for something like cake batter if it's a little thick, you can spritz it with a little distilled water to get it the consistency you like. We're simply going to put a small amount of chalk paste on our squeegee like so. And apply it to the entire stencil using your squeegee at a 90 degree angle and just simply Spread it all across your stencil, just like this. We just want to make sure that we get all of the silk screen covered. putting any leftover chalk paste back into my container so we can use it on our next project. Chalk paste goes a long way. So as you can see, I've covered all of the stencil in a very thin coat of chalk paste. Now, you are simply going to remove your stencil using your fingers on two corners and you're going to want to pull it either top to bottom or left to right to keep from stretching your stencil. You'll want to immediately wash your stencil using water and a sponge. You'll lay it flat on a surface with the sticky side up to dry for about 24 hours before returning it to the backing. If you have any questions, you can leave those in the comments below. You can follow me on Facebook at Magnolia Design Creator. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button below so that you never miss a video. Have a happy day, Chalkers.